Well, we just left the Duarte area was it, where it wasn't really raining that bad. It wasn't coming down hard, but we recently just crossed over into the San Bernardino County line, entering into Rancho Cucamonga now. And take a look at what we're seeing right here. I'm going to switch it over, and the water is coming down a little bit harder here. When we get close to some of those cars, you can see it's churning out that water, spreading it back onto, onto our windshield. And that is why drivers here taking it slow, taking in this slick road. We heard Kirk talking about all of those the, all of those issues that it's causing now on the freeways here on the 210. It sort of ebbs and flows, Alina. It, at certain parts, it does become more trafficy, not necessarily because of the amount of cars, but because of those conditions. It's tough to see in certain areas as the rain starts coming down harder, making it really difficult for drivers. We can see some of the some of the braking is created here a little bit more in this area because the rain is now coming down harder but Alina it's not this storm is not only affecting the Inland Empire here it's turning roads treacherous in other areas across Los Angeles take a look at this this is 101 at Fountain slow moving cars through these morning showers it's very slow going with traffic and here is a look from downtown overhead just to give you a bird's eye view you can see that snail's pace that cars are moving not necessarily Necessarily again because there are a lot of cars but because those slick roads and rain coming down making those conditions difficult for drivers to see so they're taking it slower on the road now take a look over at Azusa overnight you can see here heavy rainfall near highway 39 cars having to navigate through those showers just really taking its toll on driver visibility. We know the rain is going to keep coming. It's not over yet. Back here in Duarte, the rain is now coming down a little bit harder. You can hear it sort of on the windshield and the down on top of the car. Now, fortunately for us here on the 210, not too much traffic because we were going east way. It's not the same in the opposite side of the road. That traffic is really starting to build up here on the 210, but that's pretty much what it looks like from our our neck of the woods we'll keep it uh, going we're headed gonna keep going towards the east but for now we'll send it back to you guys in the studio